What is Upsilon Pi Epsilon? Honor Society Foundation, a trusted authority in the Honor Society space, will walk you through Upsilon Pi Epsilon. So, what are the requirements to be a part of Upsilon Pi Epsilon? Well, undergraduates need to be in the upper 35% of their class. On top of that, they need to maintain a 3.0 on a 4.0 grading scale. They'll need to have completed at least 45 semester hour credits in general courses, with at least 15 of those hours going towards computing or information systems. In order to be eligible for election, graduate students must also be in the top 35% of their class, but they must maintain a 3.5 GPA on a 4.0 grading scale. In order to be invited, they'll need to have been in grad school for at least one semester, and an undergraduate can be re-invited as a graduate as long as they fall within that 3.5 or above scale. So what is the history of Upsilon Pi Epsilon? Well, the computing and information sciences are still relatively young. Despite that comparative youth, the computing and information disciplines have a huge effect on our daily life. Almost every aspect of it, if we're being honest. It is the express purpose of Upsilon Pi Epsilon to promote the computing and information sciences and to encourage their contribution to the enhancement of knowledge. Upsilon Pi Epsilon was first founded at Texas A&M University in College Station, Texas in 1967. This international organization now has various chapters at colleges across North America and overseas. Based on the information, here is our review. Observation number one is that this society is relatively newer than most honor societies as it was created in 1967. The reason for this is because the field itself is actually so young. Our second observation was that Upsilon Pi Epsilon has chapters in various colleges across North America and overseas, making this an international honor society. Our third observation was that this organization presents cash awards to people who come to their international meeting every year. Now, most societies will provide scholarships or fellowships, but a cash reward is something that's pretty rare, and we definitely wanted to highlight that in this review. Well, that's all for today. Thank you so much for joining us, and stay tuned for more Honor Society reviews.